All right, we've been celebrating Pet Week all week long here on Brightside. We know you love your fur babies, maybe your feathered friend. Yeah, we got a little bit of everything, don't we? We want to send it over to Jabari Thomas now for our Pet of the Day Spotlight. What's up, my man? Oh, this is so fun. Y'all joining me is Dr. Jamie Kulaga Ooh. and her mini <laughs> macaw, Marley. Marley, <laughs> So you own a bird. How cool is having a bird, actually? Because a lot of people do have them for pets. Yes, it's it's amazing. She's so lovable. She's cuddly. She's great. Uh, yeah, oh. yes, you are. I'm bragging on you. Um, but it, it does require responsibility. Uh -huh, uh -huh. They are social. They need interaction. They need to be able to go places with you and do things. Yeah. Uh, it's not something that you want to, uh, an animal that you want to stick in a cage, close, and come back 10 hours later. Right, they right. love the talking and the interaction. That, so it's very important that if people do get decide to get a macaw or a parrot, that they, you, know, you have to be interactive and not just leave them in a cage. But they do live a very long time, which is a good thing. Yes, and this one might outlive me. Um, <laughs> so, yes. Ah! Hello. Ah! Hello. Hi. Yeah, so I'm really nice to my oldest son, so that that way maybe at some point <laughs> he will take her for me. Um, yeah, but she's fun. She comes on the boat with us. She comes down to Key West with us. She talks. She says, Grandma. Grandma, if you're watching, ah! you'll love that. Hello. Oh! She says, hello. She, hello, Grandma. Is that what you said? Uh, shower, cook. Come here, Mama. Uh -huh. um, she'll be five in August. Five years old, mm -hmm. so she has like 95 more years to go with this. <laughs> completely so awesome. So an alternative. So instead of maybe a dog or a cat, why do you think people should get a bird? Like what personality do you think uh, a, a person owning a bird should have? Oh, man, like a gypsy, free spirit. Yeah. Um, enjoy. My husband and I are super, like, musical and Key West and relaxed, and they're super chill. Yeah, they um, are. People come over, and you feel like you're in a tropical island. Uh -huh. So, um, and it's just a different kind of animal to have. I love her. Right. They're beautiful birds yes. as well. Now, this is a mini macaw. Yep. Redhead. Uh, so, red, so it's a red-fronted macaw and a mini macaw, also known as a severe macaw. Yeah. That's what she is, and she'll stay this size. She'll stay this beautiful. We love her. Y'all go get yourselves a bird, all right? This is so <laughs> cool. Thank you so much, Dr. Jamie Brown. By the way, a quick fact here. Birds have a bone in their tongue. Yeah. Nobody? No. Okay, that's cool. Okay, now look at your <laughs> forecast. Thank you so much, Jamie. Thank bye, you. Marley. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Can you say bye? Bye. She can go take a shower. Yeah, shower. <laughs> <laughs>